Hi, this is Jackie with the Builder All team. In this tutorial, we are going to verify our sender email because it's very important step to ensure that your emails are delivered to the subscribers in their inbox. But before we continue, it's important to remember that you do need to have a domain connected already to your website. Also, you need to make sure that you have a custom email created. If you don't have a custom email, you're just going to go to your dashboard and you're going to click on custom email and then we're going to click on the domain that's associated with it we're going to click create email so in this case i'm just going to call it training at jackie de clark i'm going to give it a password and i'm going to click create and that has been created but that does not mean that it's been verified so to verify in, in mailing boss on the left hand side we're going to go to settings scroll down to sender emails then we're going to create a new sender email we're going to click for this and choose the domain that is associated with that account and we're going to give it a name and we're going to choose the account and then we're going to click ok for save and now you can see that it's been generated and the message at the top tells you that it has not yet been verified because you actually need to go and log in so let's go back to the custom email area we're going to click on view email list and we are going to go to that account now in this case because there's two emails it's going to go to the same account, but I'm going to show you how to do that. We're going to click on Access Webmail. And you're going to see right here at the top that Jackie de Clark is the one that's been associated. We need to add another account to it. So let's click on Add. And the one that we want to add is Training. And we need to put in our password. And we're going to click on add and the reason why we are doing this is because we want to make sure that we are adding the or going to go and find the the verified email that we need to click on so now you can see if we go to the drop down list there is the training we're going to click on training and it will open up that training account in rain loop and you can see there's the validation we're going to click on that one we're going to click on the one at the top and it says congratulations that it has been done then we're going to go back to our custom e or our email in mailing boss and we are just going to refresh the screen and now that it's been refreshed you're going to see there is a tick which means that the email for the sender email is basically verified and you are ready to use it and that is all from this training i will see you in another bye